resident place, Laval, Quebec, Canada, from Montmorency College, representing of the Czech Republic, this is our delegation. Quand on est arrivé à Sherbrooke, qui était notre préparation officielle avant New York, on n'avait pas focusé sur le pays, on a pu vraiment euh, comprendre l'émotion. Sauf qu'en même temps, ça a été un petit peu euh, une claque euh, d'en face de voir qu'il faut être prêt. Puis euh, ça a sonné des cloches. To see, then it was totally different than to be at the Parliament of Quebec that I have do during two consecutive years in February 2007 and 2008. Someone said, it's just political things, but the preparation that I need to do, that I needed to do five and four years ago, it's totally different than the preparation that I, need to, that I have need to do during the last year. I remember when we were in Sherbrooke, we, was, we were like devastated because we didn't do, basically we didn't do anything. Any, they're like, None people wanted to work with us because they thought that we were um, that we were too young or too immature. Uh, in this case, it was really like a shock for us, for all of us. And uh, Dominic and William and Valerie were um, were basically there for us to say like it's not going to happen uh, in New York. As far as traveling, I think the. On the way to New York, everyone's excited and the traveling is just, uh, it goes by so fast because everyone's excited, we all want to go to New York, we all have energy, we're motivated. So, I mean, the, the traveling and go there wasn't really an, an obstacle. Uh, pour l'aller, je dirais que c'était impossible de dormir, c'était impossible de fermer l'œil tout simplement, ne serait-ce que par la nervosité ou par ce qui se disait en arrière. You can't really describe an MUN until you did it, because it's something that you can't put words on it. Um, you just come to, to that point when you're maybe not experienced and you just jump into this and give you 100% every day, every time, every morning. We, we did not sleep a lot of hours and we did not like eat that much also, but I think it was expected and it's a week that you give 100%, you're motivated and it was expected. The best part is Times Square. You can't You can't walk in Times Square and don't say wow every time you walk in Times Square. Uh, from from the Marriott till the Sheraton, it was amazing. Like everything was so colorful and lighting and it was very nice. Obviously with all the lights and uh, the attractions at night, it's it's tough to not to be attracted to, towards that. Mon cas, dans une chambre de filles, c'est sûr que ça s'est bien déroulé, mais qu'il y avait euh, beaucoup de vêtements par terre dans la chambre. Euh, et pour euh, partager la salle de bain, le miroir, surtout qu'il y avait des petits conflits, mais en général, ça s'est bien passé. Je pense que nous, on avait quand même une bonne simplicité, une bonne complicité. Je suis en natural science et je n'ai pas appris politique et ce qui est vraiment se passe dans notre monde. Je ne sais pas. Donc, c'était une really refreshing expérience. Le meilleur moment de the experience where we were all in the same room sharing what we did. Um, uh, yeah, our fears and our stronger uh, part of it. And I just want to say thank you to everyone for making like this experience so special to me. For my part, I think that my my best souvenir I, I will keep for the NMU and it's probably uh, all of the cooperation between each states, each member states. Le souvenir euh, le moins positif que je dirais, pour pas dire négatif, euh, de la semaine à New York, en fait, c'est qu'on n'avait pas passé à travers plus d'un sujet. Euh, notre sujet prioritaire était le deuxième, donc euh, ça a été une certaine déception. Pour le retour, euh, je dirais que ça a été un peu plus facile. Euh, J'ai été capable de dormir un peu pour dire que le stress était descendu et l'envie de pouvoir dormir dans, dans notre lit, de, de retrouver nos affaires. Euh, le tout, euh, ça, ça, vaut, euh, ça vaut au moins 7-8 heures de sommeil facile dans une journée. I think uh, my greatest souvenir would, mo would be the closing ceremony at the, uh, at the UN. Just the feeling of uh, accomplishment uh, of everyone and everyone being happy and relaxed. It was a great experience. Um, we've grown up as a person, as a student. Um, it was great knowing all those peoples from around the world and uh, I think uh, everyone should try it once in their life. But definitely be part of it a second time, uh, not only because of the experience that you get with within the NMUN, 
because it is really enriching and uh, it's really something that makes you learn a lot on yourself and on your and on your uh, delegates, fellow delegates. But I think also that in those kind of experience, you learn a lot uh, about other people and with other people throughout their relationships and the friendships that you you make. And I think that uh, I would I would be part of an experience like that anytime. Resident Place, Laval, Quebec, Canada, from Montmorency College, representing the Chef Ripoff. Euh, je nous vois encore les cinq devant le même miroir à placer nos nœuds de cravate. Euh, ça, c'était juste drôle. Et surtout la fois que la femme de ménage... La femme de ménage, oui. La femme de ménage. <rire> Un gars de point... L'accent de point de calimet, quand même. 